So you want to eat 1500 calories pizza and cake which you can eat in your fat loss journey? Check out this video. But before you do that, you have to subscribe to my channel so that whenever I upload a video in future, you get the notification. I love the Hey what is going on guys Harsh here welcome back to my channel and today we are going to make some low calorie 1500 calories pizza and cake actually it's a brownie not a cake you can say it a brownie as well and this time i'm going to speak a little bit slow because in my last video people were commenting a lot that uh, i actually was speaking really fast and uh, if you haven't seen that video i'll give the link of that video in the description you guys go and check it out have a look on that video if you really think that i was speaking fast then comment down below again i'll try to improve myself for that so let's start with the cardio first because uh, the today's saturday and today's no gym day no workout day so right now i'm having my black coffee here because it fills, fills me up with the caffeine and drinking a uh, black coffee during a fast it it actually helps you to burn more calories and burn more fat while your cardio sessions or whatever workout sessions you are doing if you are doing a fasted workout so i really recommend to drink a black coffee before your workouts so as you guys already know i do a cardio kickboxing 30 minutes routine and i do it from a channel named called hasfit you just go and check it out that's a super awesome channel they also have a app now uh, they not only help you with the cardio and they also help you with the diets and everything uh, they have many playlist of uh, even cardio kickboxing and your aerobics zumba and many more other types of home workouts and uh, just go and check it out i'll give the link in the description <sighs> let's start cardio now <laughs> done this many time but still it's never easy let's start cooking pizza now i'll be making my pizza on the pan i recommend to make it on the pan you can also make it in the oven but still i recommend you to make it in the pan because it uh, makes the base of the pizza the crust of the pizza very crispy because the eggs eggs are the base of the pizza here so you have to make it in a omelet style it should be a little bit crispier so i prefer pan you can make it in the oven so the ingredients of this meal are 3 tablespoon of mayonnaise 1 tablespoon of texicana salsa 1 tablespoon of mozzarella cheese two eggs because they are the base one cup chopped broccoli half bell pepper one medium sized onion and one chicken breast yeah so what i do is i put a little bit of oil on this actually it's a little bit too much but still no problem you just have to cover each and every corner of the pan so that it doesn't stick let it be a little bit of warm like i have kept it on 7 and uh, now i'm going to pour the base i'm going to pour the base and so that it, it, there is just a little bit of base already created on this so that when you put your ingredients it doesn't stick to the ground Six or seven. That's it. I am going to check it out from time to time after fifteen minutes or seventeen minutes because I don't really want it to burn. A few moments later. It looks good. It smells amazing though. See? Yeah, I just have to scratch out the sides so that it doesn't stick while I am taking it out. And yeah, it's moving now. So oh, yeah, I put little bit of chili powder on this thing, and I also like to put little bit of curry masala because curry powder you can say because it gives that Indian touch to the pizza. So this thing has 650 calories, guys, and I put the macronutrients on the screen. You just have a look and try it out, guys. It's really very yummy. So guys, let's try it out because I'm really hungry right now, and yeah.
Ô mê Ô mê Ô It really took less than two minutes for us to eat this thing. It's that yummy. I'm telling you guys, you, ha you have to try this out at your home. Finally, it's evening time right now, guys, which means this is the time for the dinner. So yeah, let's start cooking the cake. So the ingredients of this recipe are pretty simple, guys. Nothing very fancy. Two spoons of peanut butter, two bananas, uh, two spoons of cocoa powder, little bit of baking powder, and 100 ml of milk, and one egg. I also add whey protein in this because of uh, the extra protein and uh, if you are taking a protein then go for a chocolate flavor or a little bit of cream and cookie types flavor don't go for vanilla or something else because they don't have that much of strong flavor which is required for this recipe and if you don't take whey protein then what I recommend is just increase the quantity of the eggs one or two which will increase the protein content in the pro meal so yeah one or two eggs or three eggs max that's it so I start with the egg. I start beating the egg uh, until unless there are some bubbles formed formed in the egg. You see this foamy texture guys? As soon as you see this texture, just add two spoons of peanut butter in this. Yeah, now this is how it looks right now. We'll just start mixing it. So now what we have to do is we have to start mashing these uh, bananas in the plate. You can also do it in a mixer but uh, I personally do it in the plate because it is very easy to transfer in the bowl. So adding your cocoa powder and mixing it with the milk first and then pouring it into the recipe it will be very easy as compared to just put it in this and mix it for the while because it's going to take time guys. So yeah that's it guys I'll just put it in the oven for 10 minutes and then you'll see the magic happening. A few moments later So this is the final look of this guys looks sick right I'm telling you guys you definitely have to try it out it's really very very yummy and you can also eat it while your fat loss or weight loss journey so yeah this is it for this video guys please subscribe to my channel and like share comment see you in the next video